Appalachian Wireless is Appalachian Advantage. Unlimited text, talk, and two gigs of data for as low as $45 a month. Or if you like, get five lines on eight gigs of data for just $145 a month. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Ghosts, goblins, vampires, and princesses were lurking in Williamson Saturday during the second Williamson Spook Fest. The Williamson Convention and Visitors Bureau hosted the event at the historic Williamson Memorial Fieldhouse in West Williamson. Waves of CBB has been very active this year. We're trying to really support community involvement here in Williamson. And we're just so thankful for everyone who comes out to our events and, and really supports what we're trying to do. Around 1,500 people attended the event this year. Children and adults had the chance to trick-or-treat, visit different vendors, booths, and attractions, listen to music, and enjoy delicious homemade food and treats. And of course, we have the support of our community and a lot of our community businesses that came tonight to do our trick-or-treat hour from 5 to 6 to give out candy and make sure the children don't go home with an empty treat bag. The Ghostbusters West Virginia Division, which is a charity cosplay group, attended the event. The organization brought the largest Stay Puffed balloon in the world. We do things like visit kids in hospitals. Our biggest charities that we help are the American Heart Association and the Children's Home Society of West Virginia. We raise funds all year and we go out shopping all night on Black Friday and try to fulfill the Christmas list for a lot of kids who otherwise wouldn't have a Christmas. And attending events like Williamson Spookfest is one of the group's favorite things to do. This is a thing that we sort of like to do twofold. We're able to, to help kids and at the same time we're out bringing cool stuff to these places that don't generally get a whole lot of things. Organizers are already gearing up for next year's Williamson Spookfest. In Williamson, Shelby Porter, EKB News.